Hey everybody, for today's video, we're going to be playing Gold Miner Malphite in the top lane, and we're playing up against Malawi, where I'm going to be using First Strike. I took Treasure Hunter, and we're just trying to collect as much gold as possible from uh, from these enemy champions. Now, I might be denied a little bit in this matchup, because, you know, it's a, it's a freaking Malawi, right? And I'm a tank. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a poor tank about to be abused by an Malawi. And before I build full AP and just farm entire waves worth per for Strike Brock. Which is the the total idea of this video. So every time I'm gonna be getting my uh first strike ready to go, I'm just gonna walk up Q. And eventually, when I start just one shotting these squishies on the enemy team, uh I'm basically gonna be uh just like farming like crazy. It's gonna be like, uh, you know, what you can do as part of this. I'm gonna be doing on a freaking mouth fight. So, if you guys don't know, like, first strike is like you gain gold based on the damage dealt during the uh, the first strike period, right? So, early on in the game, I'm just gonna be, you know, pressing my Q. Get a little bit of gold, getting a little bit of poke, you know, whatever. But as the game goes on, and I'm building full AP Malphite, then I'm going to be absolutely just shredding uh, enemy team and getting a ton of extra gold in return. So, let's see. He's going to have a little bit of CS advantage, but you got to remember, I'm going to have my first strike, and uh, we farming. So, I went Biscuits of Corrupting Potion. We've avoided her E so far. However, we do take a bad E. It's not the end of the world. Just because we do have plenty of sustain. So along with having the uh, the obvious uh, mana. Not come for these items. Oh, man. Looks like she is, like, stuck in the bush. You know, she's got no mana. You know, I think she should be a little bit concerned about the fact that she's got no mana. I got my first strike ready. Ooh. Get a little, little bit of a trade there. I kind of want to prevent him from just, like, shoving all the way in. And honestly, we might even be able to look for a kill here. If he gets low enough. So we can avoid these tentacles pretty easily. I have to avoid this next one coming up though. Got first strike up soon. I think this guy's about to just back in TP. <laughs> okay, I thought he was going to back in TP and said he just chose death. That's fine with me, too. Let me go take it back. I've got my lost chapter. I'm going to be uh, loveless, you know, likely to die. Now, if they're always going to come back, she's going to come with some, maybe some MR or something. We'll see. We'll see what this guy does. You know, 300 gold is pretty awkward because I did go magical full wear. Can't go boots. I don't really want to go tabbies. I want to go sorks. I don't have enough for a dark seal. So, not the absolute best back we could have gotten, but it's pretty decent. The fact that we got lost chapter on this back and we're going to be getting 20% of our max mana over three seconds really nice. So, one thing with the changes that you guys might not realize is you saw how I was able to just auto attack the Alawi, even though all these minions were here. Yeah, so the reason I was able to walk in and just deal all that damage to Alawi and not take any mini damage is because Riot changed the mini aggro. So that if the minions are already attacking the turret, they will not switch off the turret no matter what. 
So usually the minions would sometimes like Diagra just randomly attack the enemy wave or they would like, you know, perform normally because when you get attacked by an enemy champion, the enemy mini wave that's close by will just start attacking you, right? Well, not when it's hitting turret, not anymore. You just uh, Q, walk away, and yeah, okay. So every time the Sin Sao comes up top, honestly, we get a free kill. Um, let's go, Ludens. Leandris is better against a Valley, right? Because she's gonna be building some uh, some HP. I hear the thing about Ludens is that it's just better against every other person. And that's super nice. Oh, that's not looking good. Might be able to get out of it. Looks like Zen's gonna fight his way out. Okay, well, we just missed out on a plate. Oh, I lost my first strike. No infinite gold found get my first strike. Speaking of which, uh, I need to make use of my treasure hunt or some. I need to get out there and roam. Okay, so I queued her one time and look at her HP. Wow, I'm surprised that hit. Now I've got all these tentacles all around me. Oh my god, that ward was tragic. So one little thing you could do, one little slick move they can do in Malphite is if she only has a couple minions up, you can ult in E, clear the whole wave and hit her, and then the tower will start hitting her. So let's see if we can do that little trick here. Let's see if she walks up. I don't think she wants to walk up, period. Oh, can get a minion. <laughs> okay. No run. I guess we just kill her. So not only did we kill her, we just gained so much gold from our first strike at the same time. So let me just uh, be up on this turret a little bit. Okay, so we're at 274 gold gained already in nine minutes. So we've basically got almost a full champion's kill worth of uh, extra gold. That's pretty phenomenal if you ask me. And uh, when I get my treasure hunter like fully stacked, we just start walking around the map killing everybody. It's going to be pretty wonderful. We're just going to get so much gold so quickly we're going to snowball like crazy. This is like probably the ultimate snowball build. Just because of how much gold we're going to be getting. How much gold we're generating. Looks like this guy might be going into like Gore Drinker. I guess this could be like Sunder too. We'll see. Oh man. The extra Ludens damage. So from that one Q, I just generated 27 gold, by the way. Uh, let me put a pink here, to be honest. Okay. You know what? I didn't get my first strike. But you know what? We're so fast because of our move speed with our Q and our Ludens, um, that we just deal some massive damage. Okay, generating some gold, getting out of a three-man gank, and getting a double kill. Let's go. <laughs> Oh my god, they committed the Twisted Fate and the Nocturne ulti to get me too. I don't know if he has, uh, if he has Flash, I don't want to just get flashed on and die randomly. 
Not after that play. Oh my god. Um, let's see. Can we? She might have uh, TP. Okay. Doesn't look like she's TPing yet. Oh yeah, I forgot she can do this now. How annoying. <laughs> okay, just give my little back extra gold. Okay, is uh, struggling. Not gonna lie. All right, let's see this. Let's get some penetration. I'm thinking Shadow Flame, I think is the idea. Shadow Flame, I think we're going Dark Seal. I think we're going uh, Champion Hunting. We're gonna go Dark Seal, get some stacks built in towards Medjai's, and we got some treasure to collect. You know, now that I think about it, so we just need Nocturne and Bot Lane, right? So I need a Pressure Top, maybe even Kill Top, and then just Walk Bottom. Or we need to fight this uh, ocean dragon. So maybe that's what I do. If I just uh, shove top and then go to ocean dragon. I've got my level 2 ult. Yeah, let's go, let's go click that. It might be more beneficial than trying to push your plates and just going against the 04 Lally. Honestly, you probably get first blood turret mid too. Yeah, our bot lane's struggling. We need to help them out a bit. Who's TPing? Alright, collected Twisted Fates bounty. So I got first blood turret mid. I'm in like position in case they try to contest or whatever. And if this twisted face sticks around much longer, I might just have to go kill him. Yep. I might just have to go kill him. I got messed around and found out. Oh, you know what? I do need my treasure on her. Mm, let's do this. An ally has been slain. Move over. And go to. Enemy I go here. Right. I shove it in. Your turret has been destroyed. Wow, they used uh, freaking everything to kill that Caitlyn. Oh my god. I think I just saw like 5,000 abilities to kill the 2 and 6 gate. Okay, let's do this. Still need uh, three more stacks, so I need Nocturne, Barris, Bard. Yes. So we get more gold from Treasure Hunter per unique one we we collect. <laughs> that is I think it was. Oh my god. An enemy has been slain. You guys got black livery, he's got merc treads. So even with the merc treads, I'm still getting 27 gold per just because of all the extra damage I got. See, I've earned 600 gold, so I've earned two champions worth of gold from first strike. I'm moving as fast as I can. Need more of them. I need to get some stacks. Let me grab this mana and then I'll head mid. If I get mid, we could do this. Oh. Woo! I'm out of there.
All right, I was gonna flank mid, but end up walking into Nocturne sitting in the bush, which is really tragic. Also, I'm sitting on a full Shadow Flame, so I was just trying to get my treasure on our procs before, but is what it is. Go towards men. Ah, uh, Caitlyn messed up. <laughs> Man, I'm just like doing circles around the Lowey. I'm following the move speed for my Q. Full AP Malphite's so freaking fun. See, any other MR item? No, no MR. Fuck can if I Nocturne. Although, if I don't one-shot Nocturne, I think he owns me. I'm moving as fast as I can. Well, Twisted Fate revealed me, so that's unfortunate. An ally has been I was gonna look for their bot lane. I'm just going to sit here. Oh no, he... You can't be serious, you can't make this up. Oh man, this guy started TPing in front of my face. Oh god, that is so tragic. Alright, we're about to get this. <laughs> He clearly did not know. Since I was covering top. Hmm. Okay. Let's go back and pick this. So Nocturne flashed to take that away from us. It's fine. If he tries to come back in, we'll just kill him. I say my burst and Kate. Eh, maybe Nocturne can come down for this. It's not in range yet. I've got red buff and blue buff, so. Oh my gosh, look at that damage dealt. Wow, that connected the sun. Nice. I don't know where that's on. It's on Nico. Okay, I saw it. I should have been. Man, I don't even know what to do with all this gold I got. I'm just constantly rich. I guess we build, uh, you know, more penetration. Your has been destroyed. Sounds good to me. I can build, like, Medjaz Deathcap. We still haven't killed Varus, although I haven't seen him. He's been, uh, been not there. Went infinite static. Let me see if I can help this guy. I don't know. Oh, I wanted my last treasure hunter proc. The burst with Nami is insane. Oh my god. How much gold am I getting per ult, by the way? I feel like I'm getting at least 100 plus gold. Oh. Oops, sad target team is only on. 
An enemy has been slain. Get him. Oh. Alright, maybe we'll come try to look to do burn. I've got my ult coming back up soon. We can get control. They're not really fighting us. They're just like pushing randomly around the map, so. Nice, we got Baron. Um, I'm gonna grab Medjai's. Let's grab Medjai's. We'll go for Quad Dragon in two minutes. Oh, we got. Hey, we found Varus. Please! Please! I want the kill so bad. We got boots now. I just want my treasure on. I think I get like 200 gold. I got 110, okay. So I oh, I still need Nocturne too. I don't want to ult on him. I want to ult on Nocturne. I think we just shove in. Wow, oh, the guy ulted the wave. I guess he really won the wave clear. Okay. I see a trigger on our proc up here. Okay, he's getting back in this bush. Should I just blind it? You know what? I'm sad. He must have seen me. Your team Either that or he was just walking all the way around. Got it. Killing screen. So while we TP'd up, alright, I'm gonna sell my corrupting potion for a Lord Rod. Rampage. Double kill. Alright, and we're gonna build this in a death cap. So right now I am at 1,210 gold gained. That's pretty ridiculous. Let me make sure we secure these dragons though. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we got 550 gold. Plus 110 gold for the uh, treasure hunter. Or was that my first strike? I don't even know. Oh, I didn't even have first strike up. Because the Nocturne hit me first. Nice. Oh, well, now we get verse. I will literally flash this guy. All right, I got my last treasure hunter complete. So I am officially, um, how much gold I had? Got like an extra 2,000 gold from my runes, which my first strike also scales really well. First strike scales really well with damage too. All right. I need. Let's see if we can grab this red buff. Okay. Oh, nice! I get collected too. I got my twenty-five sack med eyes. I think we just one-shot anything that exists near us.
Oh, he's dead. Oh my gosh, she almost died too. Oh. Is this it for me? Oh, it is it for me. No! <laughs> oh no, my med just sex. Okay. Alright, let's get Baron and in. Oh my god, that damage. As uh, the Renasher's Rage Blade Nico. Yeah, so we are full build at 27 minutes. We've earned 1500 gold from First Strike at a 450 from Treasure Hunter. And then I don't even know what I'm going to do with all this extra gold, right? So 9% extra damage for 3 seconds is pretty insane. Concerning like how bursty Malphite is as full AP. So I do eleven hundred plus about eight hundred plus seven fifty plus an extra what like three hundred? I can't even do the math, but that plus an additional nine percent from first strike, just also gonna me gold. That's a lot of damage. And also a lot of these a lot of my damage is AoE too. Just go mid and we just end. Straight up. I, I don't think they can do anything about it. Kind of had it back there because we're so low and they had respawns coming up. But um, I think we could just go mid with our ult. One shot one, maybe even two people at once. And then win the game. Hard for them to engage too because both Nami and Nico are both amazing. <laughs> He's going to turn into a freaking ward. God, that, that champion's so funny. I don't want to engage into the uh, Nocturne. He's got the most MR and health. Okay, the double one shot. Oh my god. That was a triple. I just dealt so much damage. But yeah, I just one-shot two people at once. Absolutely insane. Hope you guys enjoyed the Gold Miner Malphite build. Anyways, hope you guys have a wonderful day. Take care. Make sure to drop a like and subscribe. Really does help out. Bye, everybody.